Hello and welcome to Smart City Expo. I'm Jonathan Catchpole from TE Connectivity and we're here representing uh, Zaga at the trade show. You've heard Zaga talk a lot about interoperability, but today I'm going to talk about flexibility of the platform we provide. So what I'm now going to show you is that we've got five different luminaires from five different manufacturers. These are all Zaga D4i luminaires, all Zaga D4i certified, so they uh, behave in the same way with the same wiring architecture, all, all dual node um, interfaces and have the same power budgets and, the, and most importantly the DALI communication. But what I want to talk about is the flexibility and the different solutions that we're showing here today. So on this first luminaire from Schrader, we have the, the simplest offering we're showing, which is a, a simple non-connected photo cell. Uh, this is a photo cell from TE Connectivity. It's a type A device. It is um, uh, using digital communication to turn the light on, turn the light off, and it also has an astral clock, uh, a virtual midnight built into it so that it will dim at certain times. So what we've been presenting is just covering the, the sensor and the luminaire uh, will turn on. Moving on, we've got an Iguzini luminaire and what we're presenting here is a type B device. So this is a motion sensor, again from TE Connectivity. And this enables energy saving by a city, by a utility. Um, so at times of non-activity, the, the, the luminaire will dim and uh, reduce the amount of energy used. And then once motion is detected, the lights will come back up to 100% brightness and providing that all important um, safety and security, which is the number one feature of, of public lighting. Moving on, we have a luminaire from Signify with their multi-sensor. This contains uh, a motion sensor again in the form of radar, as well as um, am uh, ambient temperature, uh, humidity, and a microphone as well. Again, a type B device, but here we're now showing a type A device on the top their Interact City. So the information, the data is being captured by the device here and then communicated to the Interact City, which then talks to their, their cloud to present that information to the, uh, to, to the end user, to the city, to the municipality. And then finally, moving through here, we have a, a luminaire from Sateco. And again, we have the motion sensor, the Type B device from TE Connectivity. But now we're connected to a device on the, on the top, the Type A device. So the Type B device sensors the Type A device, disables its application controller, and then communicates the motion event to the, uh, the Type A device on the top. And in this case, it is a, it's the outlet system from Schrader. This one has got mesh communication on board and it's talking wirelessly to a luminaire on the other side of the, the booth. So when motion is detected, the light comes on here, but then the light also comes on on the luminaire on the other booth. Thank you for your time today.